Good morning everyone, how is it going? I apologize in advance if I seem dysfunctional in this video, it's because I am. <laughs> the last few weeks have just been so, so crazy as you can tell by my absence. I'm a college student and I also work. And the last few weeks I was in four classes, which is the equivalent to two college students because my classes are eight weeks long. So pretty much outside of class and work, and then like obviously family time I have not had any extra time um, and then I also traveled between all the craziness so it's just been a lot that's why it's been a while since I've done like a normal vlog but I appreciate your patience with me as you just saw Aiden left we can actually see the flight line from our house so that's why we were like looking outside we as in me and Pepper right here um, but yeah, and the last day or two has been crazy because we've been preparing for Aiden to leave for TDY. And we saw him off yesterday. We saw, we thought we saw his plane leave, but it never ended up leaving because there was like a malfunction with the plane and then they ended up leaving today. So it's just been a little crazy recently, but that's okay. Also, by the way, if you're new here, my name is Katie. I'm 23 years old and I live in Okinawa with my husband and my two cats. And I like to make a daily life in Okinawa, Japan content, all that good stuff. So if that sounds fun to you, stay tuned. Tuned. almost forgot about my intro all right so as I was saying Aiden just went on TDY for the next month which means it's just me the cats and I guess you guys for the next month so that's a fun time I figure or not it's not a fun time it just it is what it is we got to make the most out of it and this is definitely not the first time Aiden's gone TDY it's definitely not my first rodeo I know how it goes but this time specifically has been really getting to me so yeah he left for TDY I also just feel like because I've been so busy I haven't even unpacked my suitcase I only just started like doing like a deep clean in my house yeah Yesterday I stopped because Aiden ended up coming home but the house could use like the bathrooms and all that good stuff could use a nice clean I also have a kickboxing kickboxing class at 10 o'clock so we're gonna do that today I'm gonna get groceries because I literally haven't done like a proper grocery shop since I got home what else and yeah this vlog is just gonna be like us hanging out me navigating me navigating Aiden being TDY and I guess you're just gonna keep me company and that's just how it's gonna be <sighs> so yeah anyways we need to get going we need to get going because Aiden just left and I don't want to like harp on it all day something I've needed to do literally since full July started it's already July 12th. I have not updated our calendar. And I'm usually a really like on top of my calendar situation, but I've just, like I said, dysfunctional recently. But it's okay. That's why we're regrouping. That's why we're doing this. It's fine. So we're gonna finally update the calendar. <laughs> Alright, calendar is filled out. Looks pretty empty because I missed half of the month, but that's okay. We wrote some words of encouragement and now on to the next thing. Alright, I did a little bit of picking up. It's now time to go to my kickboxing. Then after that we're going to head over to the grocery store and then Maybe run some other errands? Who knows? Let's go.
As you can see, you saw a few clips of that, but I went to my kickboxing class, which I should disclaim, that was only my second class. I don't know if I said that before. So I'm like very, very beginner. Also, if you can hear the planes, I'm sorry. They're just going. But yeah, anyways, I did that. I went to the bank to Navy Federal to deposit my tips from work. And then I went to the grocery store. So we're gonna do a little grocery haul. And then also, oh, I ran to the post office. I didn't want to go. I didn't want to do any of this, but it has to get done. So here we are. Let's do a little grocery haul, shall we? I only got a few things because it's Wednesday, and I'm going to probably go to the grocery store this weekend at some point. So I just got stuff for the meals we need uh, for the, like, the next two days. We, as in myself. First things first. This, I call this my lazy girl salad kit because, well, everything's already chopped up for you. And I'm pretty sure it's just cabbage, onions, corn, and carrots, I think. So you can just throw that all together. Two strips of this Australian beef. So I was looking for cauliflower rice, but all I could find was broccoli rice, which I've never seen before. So I got two of them. Two cucumbers, beautiful frozen berries. I think the frozen food in Japan is superior to America. It tastes so fresh and so cheap. Two chicken breast, one Meiji milk or whole milk because it's just me. Two of these um, top value brand Greek yogurts bananas. I've tried this brand of mandu before. Usually I get the kimchi one, but this one's just, I think it's a, just like a regular Korean style. Yeah, Korean flavor mandu. So I figure this could be like a quick little meal. And lastly, I got some cheddar cheese. So that is everything. I did go to the commissary yesterday and get a couple things. So like I said, this is not a usual grocery haul, and this is also for one person, and I'm used to shopping for two. And all of this costs this much. I just feel like when Aiden leaves, 
I don't want to say I shut down because I'm not shutting down. I'm still doing things, but I like kind of check out a little bit for the first few days. Sit. Sit. Good. <laughs> so something that I really struggle with when Aiden does leave is my sleep. I just don't sleep as well. So I have to make an effort to make sure that I'm doing everything I can to make sure I sleep without melatonin, of course, because that's become a really bad habit of mine. And when he leaves, I'll take melatonin every night to the point where it'll stop working. So I need to not depend on melatonin. So I need to be like actively doing things to make sure I sleep well. One of those things being making sure I spend time outside because I know there's like science to this and I'm probably not going to say it correctly, but going outside really helps with your circadian rhythm. Now we're going to go for a walk just to get our little exercise in and hopefully I sleep tonight. It is Friday morning um, and I'm getting ready for work and I thought I would just update you on how my day is going, how I'm feeling since Aiden's been gone, all that good stuff. I didn't really vlog yesterday much just because I pretty much, what did I do? Went to the gym, went for a walk made dinner, did a lot of work, got my video edited. Originally this morning, I was going to go to the gym, but A, I didn't take a rest day this week, so I'm really sore and I figure, you know what, my body's telling me to rest, so I'm gonna rest and I'm not gonna feel bad about it. And it's just how it's gonna be. <laughs> I get in my head sometimes when I take rest days, but I know I needed it this morning. Also, I have a ton of editing to get done on top of I have a paper due this week like I just have a lot going on um so yeah that is why I didn't go to the gym but that's okay because I got my video done and edited which was actually super frustrating because so originally when I planned on going to Tokyo I planned on having this whole like idea like long idea of vlogs I was gonna do and I was super excited about it but the thing is is like for most people Tokyo is like a big deal, right? Like not every day do you get to go to Tokyo. However, in my case, I go to visit my mom. Like I don't really, like I go to do stuff and we do stuff, but it's not like, oh my gosh, like I'm in Tokyo. It's just like, we just do what we do and we catch up or whatever. So I didn't vlog as much as I would, I hope to. And I only got one video other than the Disney vlog out of the footage that I had and also oh my god um 
the footage I got just wasn't very good. I don't know. I hope I'm not out of focus right now. I've been having a lot of issues trying to stay in focus and I cannot figure it out on my camera. So I feel like the whole video, I'm just like out of focus, which is really frustrating, but I didn't want to scrap the whole vlog. So I just did it. I'm going to upload it probably tonight. I still have to make a thumbnail, but anyways, I'm happy with my decision to just stay home this morning, get my work done and then go, go to work. In terms of how I'm like actually feeling since Aiden's left, I feel like the loneliness has kind of kicked in. Um, but it's weird because I still don't want to hang out with anyone, but I also am feeling lonely. I don't know how to explain it. It's just weird. Like I'm lonely, but I don't want to hang out with anyone. I don't know. Gotta stay strapped. Look at that. Look at that all ring. So cute. If you didn't know, it is customary to bring a souvenir from where you travel to to your workplace, which I work a morning and night shift, and I already brought over a souvenir from Disney to my night shift, but I haven't worked a morning shift since I went to Disney. So I'm bringing them this little Duffy souvenir. How cute is this? And if you didn't know, th this collection of characters is like a Disney Sea exclusive thing, so it's only in Japan. But I believe that there's rice crackers in there, and a lot of my morning shift is Japanese people, so I'm hoping they enjoy the little Duffy treats. Let's go to work. As you saw, I went to the Kombini. There is a family mart close to my house because if you live in Japan, there's pretty much gonna be some type of Kombini or convenience store within five minutes of walking distance of your house. I got Lawson's on one side and Family Mart on the other and I'm like, which one are we feeling today? But I would say that Family Mart to me has a better food option. There's things that I like about each Kombini, but like for instance, Lawson's has the best tuna mayo onigiri. I don't know why, they just do. But like Family Mart has the best coffee and they have better food choices than Lawson's. And actually my preference is 7-Eleven, but I don't have one in walking distance of my house. So we made it work. I just did not feel like leaving the house and I was like, should I get Indian food? Should I get Thai food? No, I'm just gonna watch for the kombini. So that's what I did. And I'm gonna show you what I got. Starting with little tiny bottles of wine, which is perfect for me because I'm by myself. Next, I got a Caesar salad. We got dressing, croutons, bacon, lettuce, just the whole, the whole situation. Secondly, I could not tell you the last time I've had one of these. It's not really something I buy very often because obviously it's like not healthy, but I was craving pizza and I found this. It's called, it's a pizza stand margarita. Basically, it's kind of like, it's kind of like a calzone. It's like a pizza roll up. But I mean, it's cheap, it's nothing crazy, but it does the job. I was craving pizza, so there you go. Also, I had to get a Fami chicken, which I'm so excited to eat. 
to accompany me in watching my show, I got these cheese puffs. How fun are those? I got an Aquarius for hydration. These are my favorite chocolate covered nut. They're hazelnut and not all kumbinis have them. I actually haven't found these in a really long time. Um, so when I saw them, I had to grab them. Just in case I was needing a little sweet ice cream situation, I got Pino. Pino is pretty much just like a chocolate covered ice cream drop, which I'll probably show you later when I eat it, but how cute. Let's try this Caesar salad. You can't go wrong with the Caesar salad. Call me chicken. Wow. Cheers. Mmm. It's just the juiciest fried chicken you'll ever have. Look at that. Amazing. Let's crack open this pizza. He already heated it up for me, so it's already warm. <gasps> mm. I think I need to heat it up again. That's the inside. Yeah. It's okay. It's not hitting like I thought it would. I'm gonna save everything else for later, so I don't wanna open it. But I hope you enjoy that little kumbini with Katie. <gasps> That's kinda cute. Kumbini with Katie. <laughs> Love that.